Hello viewers, I believe everyone is doing well. Welcome to my channel. Today our design is a fully embroidered frock design, which will have quite heavy work on the frock. So let's begin. We have taken full measurements here and created a dummy to make the design process easier. Now we will start from the upper part of the frock and create a half-sided scarf. On this, we'll work on the design, incorporating heavy beadwork, pearls, sequins, and zari work. We will use this as a separate design element, which won't be stitched to the frock, but rather attached with a heavy lace. This way, we can tie it around the upper part of the frock and easily remove or adjust it. This scarf will be on the half portion of the frock, covering the hand. Now, we will work on the sleeves and the rest of the frock design. The frock will have a slightly flared look to enhance its appearance in real life. Now, we will refine our design with the help of a pointer to give it a complete shape, and we'll erase the remaining rough work with an eraser. our design is taking on a somewhat different look. Now we'll focus on colors, and choosing a color can be a bit challenging. So we'll paint the entire frock in pink, except for the upper part which we'll leave untouched. Now, we will mix purple and yellow paint for the scarf, creating a color similar to henna. We will apply this color to the entire scarf. black color to the upper part of the frock where we left it untouched. After that, we'll use black paint and a marker to create an outline for the entire frock. Next, we will use yellow paint and green metallic color to depict threads in our designs. Then, for the bunches, we'll create them using shades of golden and copper colors. of the scarf's lower side, we've added heavy golden embellishments. Now in the scarf, we will create the design using black metallic color, incorporating black surrey work or shiny black threads.
will use pink metallic color to create shiny motifs at the bottom of the frock. After that, we'll use green metallic color to work on the details of the bead. Following that, we'll make flower motifs using the pink color. Then, we will create leaves using green metallic color. Now, we'll use gold metallic color on the scarf as well. In the design, we will incorporate beads to work on the details of the beads and pearls. Lastly, we'll use pink metallic color to make flowers in the design, or wherever we need them throughout the design. details of the beads and pearls. Now, we will use light paint to add highlights to the layers. liked our video and if you did enjoy it please please subscribe to the channel then watch the complete video like comment and if you feel like it please do share it as well thank you for watching my videos goodbye bye bye